everybody welcome back i know it's been a couple of weeks since i've posted i ended up going to the beyonce renaissance world tour in houston texas and had the time of my life however when i left i got sick with a really bad sinus infection and have been down bad for like the last two weeks i'm just now starting to feel better um, anytime I'm like feeling bad, I try to treat myself with like some retail therapy um, just to try to like make myself feel a little bit better. And so since I'm starting to feel better, I did spend the weekend doing some shopping. So I thought it would be nice to show you guys some of the things that I purchased over the weekend. All right, so I want to start with some of the things that I got from Sephora. Um... You don't need that. Okay. So I did stock up on the Fenty Beauty Uncensored, like the lip paint. This is actually what I'm currently wearing. I just decided to buy another bottle because the bottle that I'm currently using is pretty much on its last leg. This is my favorite, favorite, favorite red lipstick. I love it so much and it's literally like paint like it's not gonna go anywhere this is a classic this is my favorite go-to red lipstick so running low so i decided to go ahead and get another bottle of this so that is something that i bought over the weekend from sephora i think it's like 25 dollars something like that i also decided to get some more setting spray um so this is what it currently is it's the urban decay all-nighter ultra matte because for me personally i don't like the dewy look i like to look super matte not to like the point that i'm looking ashy but i do like to have like a matte look going on so something else that i purchased over this weekend i don't know why i'm spraying my hand but yeah all right some other things that I purchased from Sephora includes the new Fenty Beauty. They're like eyeshadow sticks. What are they called? Shadow sticks. And so I purchased them in a couple of different colors. Let's see, this first one, the color is called Get On Taupe. Get on top, get on taupe, get on taupe. And so this is like the container that it's in. It's super, super cute. Um, I'm gonna open that. And it is literally so pretty. It glides on super pretty. I think it's beautiful. So it looks really nice. So I can't wait to wear it. And I also bought it in another color called Gold Hoops. And I'll show you what that looks like. Again, a super, super cute container. Um, there's like actually a lot of product in here. And so I know that this is gonna last like a long time. Again, it glides on super pretty. Looks really, really good. Can't wait to try it and actually wear it on my face. Um, okay, a few other things that I got from Sephora. Okay, so y'all already know how Sephora is and a lot of like retail stores honestly are like this where they put all these cute little things at the cash register and so when you go to check out, there's so much temptation and I, did not successfully make it to the cash register without picking something else up. I decided to pick up the Tom Ford, I think it's Soleil Blanc, um, a shimmering body oil, and y'all, this is so cute. And I literally could not resist because it was only $34. It was only $34. And it's just so pretty and it smells so good. And I just am like one of those girls who like, when I go out, I like to shimmer, I like to sparkle. One of my friends literally makes fun of me because she's like, she says something along the lines of like, when I go out that I like to 
shimmer like I am on the coast or the sands of Africa or something so but I'm super super excited to try this um, like I said it smells really good I'm just gonna spray some on my hand I don't know if you guys can actually really see it but it smells really good and it's super shimmery and I love it so I ended up putting some of it on my arm. I don't know if you can see it, but it is a little bit shimmery. It's very oily. And like I said, it smells really, really good. And I just could not resist because it was only $34 in. I was weak. Okay, some of the other things that I got. Okay. I said it was just a few things, but it's kind of a lot. Um, I think this was a free gift from Sephora. I don't know what this is because I'm like, I did not pick this up, but I think this is something that like a sample or something that the cashier threw in there. I don't know what this is. It's a JVN air dry cream. I don't know what this is for. I think it's like some kind of hair product. Yeah. It says air dry perfection diffuser nailed it work desired amount through any kind of hair to add buildable touchable hold that lets your natural texture shine i probably won't ever use this but thanks sephora okay some of the other stuff that i got um if you've seen my last video or one of my recent videos over the fenty body creams You'll already know how I feel about Fenty body creams or the body butters. I ended up getting this butter drop in the shimmering whipped oil. Um, it is like a holiday. Ugh, smells really, really good. For those of you, like I said, who've seen my last video on the Fenty, um, like the perfume body cream, you already know. Like. Fenty just does really good when it comes to skincare. It smells very sweet and um, like cinnamon, very moisturizing. And like I mentioned in my last video, you don't have to use a lot. A little bit goes a long way. And I'm so glad that Fenty decided to um, drop this again because they dropped it uh, last winter, I believe. And I actually didn't get a chance to get it. So I'm so glad that it's back and it smells really good. They also have dropped recently like a trio of all three of like the body creams, the body butters, and they're like minis. So it's super cute. I did not get that, but I probably will get that soon. Um, yeah. All right. Um, some of the other things that I got from the holiday collection was the body and face scrub duo. Um, so I'll take that out and let you guys see that. So this is the Cherry Dub Body Scrub and this is the Face Scrub. So I'm super excited to try these. I haven't tried it. My best friend, I believe, has this and she says that it's like amazing. So I'm excited to see how I like it. Um, and I might do a review on it, possibly. Um, okay, next by Fenty is the Fruit quenchers it is the lip oils like the duo it's also from the holiday collection um let's see how i can open this so one is barbados cherry which i already have this one because it's just one that i've already had but i'm super super excited because they released a new one and it is kalahari melon so, let's see. It smells really good. And I'm sure it has like the same texture as the cherry one. So, alrighty. Okay, that is all that I got from Sephora. Um, the next store that I went to was Windsor and I don't really shop at Windsor a lot but I was looking for like a last minute outfit for like this event or whatever and came across um 
this cute little outfit. I think it's so cute. This is the top and it has a skirt that matches it. And I think it's just super, super cute. Um, I'm not gonna show it on this video, but if you follow my Instagram at Brianna Forever, you can see it on there. Um, all right, and then the next store that we went to was Forever 21. And I just got like a couple of accessories from there. I think that's it. Okay, so I got this anklet, which is super, super cute. Um, I don't know when I'm ever gonna wear it, but I think it's super, super cute. It's like um, a duo anklet. It was $9.99. And then I got this other super cute anklet. And I thought it was super cute because it has the letter B on it. Um, it was $4.99. All right, moving along. So a couple of other stores that I went to included Ross and Marshalls and one of my best friends, like the same one that said the thing about like the African sands or whatever. She also says that I'm the Ross queen because literally I can go into Ross and find the cutest things. I know some people don't like to shop at Ross because it's just like a mess and chaotic and there's stuff everywhere and you really have to like dig and search and find for like the good things but personally i'm patient when it comes to shopping and i like to take my time and i ended up finding some pretty cool things so let's go ahead and see them okay so found some cute adidas i have these same adidas in pink but i like walk my dogs so much that they are just not even pink anymore they are like black and Honestly, like no matter how much I wash them or how much I try to clean them, they are just never going to be pink again. So ended up getting some white ones and we will see how long I can keep those white. Um, other stuff that I got from Ross. Okay, I don't know what this is. But it is like really cute, some kind of decor. I have like a new office, like a new desk. And so I am gonna put this there on my desk and I think it's super, super cute. It's like golden arches, super cute. It's funny cause like when I was actually checking out at Ross, the lady behind me was like telling her mom, like that girl found so many cute things. Um, you just have to have patience when you shop at Ross. And I also found these cute slippers from um jessica simpson and so i like these a lot they're super super soft and it is fall so i feel like these are cute for fall time and it's definitely like a warm neutral fall color so super excited to wear these around the house and the last thing that i got from ross i don't know if you guys are going to be able to see it really but it's a cute doormat and it says, hey there pumpkin. And it's so super, super cute. So that is all that I got from Ross. Um, now let's get into my finds from Marshalls. So the first thing that I found, I wasn't even looking for this, But I was passing by like the perfumes and it really caught my eye, but I ended up finding this Baccarat Rouge 540 dupe. It is called Better Rouge and it was only $16 and surprisingly enough, it actually really does smell like Baccarat. Um, I've smelled other dupes and they have just not really compared personally i know like a lot of people think that cloud smells like baccarat and to me personally it doesn't but this definitely smells literally like the closest thing to baccarat and yeah it smells very similar um this is like the closest thing that i could find um that smells just like it um so if baccarat is not in your price range because it is very expensive go ahead and head to marshall's because they have better rouge for $16. <laughs> Um, other things that I found, I got um, a case for my AirPods just because my last one broke. And so just picked that up. It was also one of those things that are like 
by the checkout and while you're just waiting in line to check out they just tempt you with all those things um i also found like a cute 500 piece puzzle if you know me you know that i love puzzles and so i'm gonna spend this evening working on it and trying to see like how long it'll take me to finish it it's 500 pieces when i'm done with it i'm gonna try to frame it if possible okay and last but not least i found a super cute led battery operated flameless candle um so my office does not allow like actual candles in the building so i thought this was just super super cute i can't wait to like get some batteries and start it up and the cool thing about it is actually like made with real wax um this was i think like 9.99 so those are all the things that i purchased over the weekend if you have any questions about any of these things just let me know in the comments if you like this video make sure to give me a thumbs up and thank you so much for watching